God is saying to you today, dear reader, you have been warned. A divine being is trying to communicate with you about a specific person. This message may come as a surprise to you, but it is important that you listen and pay attention. The divine being, whom we all know as God, has a message specifically for you. This message is about a person in your life, someone who has been causing you harm or leading you astray. God is aware of their actions and is trying to guide you towards the right path. It is crucial that you pay heed to this warning, as it may be your last chance to turn things around. Like this bead if you believe in God. God has been watching over you, guiding you and protecting you from harm. However, this person in your life has been causing you to deviate from the path that God has set for you. They have been a negative influence, leading you away from your true purpose and causing you to make decisions that are not in line with God's plan for you. This person may have been manipulating you, taking advantage of your vulnerabilities, or simply tempting you to stray from the righteous path. But now, God is giving you a chance to make things right. He is reaching out to you through this message to warn you about the consequences of ignoring His guidance. If you choose to ignore this warning and continue to associate with this person, God will have no choice but to judge you. He will hold you accountable for your actions and the decisions you make. And the consequences may not be pleasant. Type I embrace my power to confirm. God is giving you a chance to break free from this negative influence and turn towards Him. He wants you to live a life filled with love, peace, and righteousness. He wants you to fulfill your true potential and follow the path that He has laid out for you. But it is up to you to make the right choice. Will you continue to ignore God's warnings and risk facing His judgment? Or will you listen and make the necessary changes in your life? Remember, God is merciful and forgiving. He is giving you this warning out of love and concern for you. He wants you to live a fulfilling life, guided by His divine wisdom. Don't let this opportunity slip away. Take heed of God's message and make the necessary changes in your life. Choose to follow God's path, and you will be rewarded with His blessings and eternal love. But if you choose to ignore God's warning, you do so at your own risk. The choice is yours. Choose wisely. Type yes if you needed this. It's already been taken care of for you, all of your dreams, desires, wants and needs. Everything has already been provisioned, not a single detail has been missed. It's all there awaiting your own recognition. Take the leap and trust that every step of the way you've been divinely supplied with every and all things aligned in your favor. There's nothing out there keeping you from all that is vested within you. Go ahead in celebration today in confidence, surety and knowing that your precious dream is coming to pass. Release all doubt, fear, anxiety, hopelessness. There is no room for false illusions. Usher in your divine manifestation within your next breath. Your dream is here and now. Comment, Amen, if you believe. You are more protected than you can ever imagine. It is safe for you to open your heart. Be open to receiving a new level of support now from your soul family.
cosmic family and the angelic beings of light. Give them permission to assist you on your journey at this time. Hand over your fears and your pain to them. You do not need to carry them anymore. You are receiving a level of support that you can't even imagine. Open yourself up to receiving more support by consciously seeing the signs and making the physical effort to receive the help and support you need at this time. Your heavenly supporters will create opportunities and bring in divine connections, but you must make the effort and take the first step to receive. When you hurt, work on healing yourself. Your focus must always be on your inner self and not on those who hurt you. You don't need to send love or hate to them. Just focus on your healing, setting your boundaries, stepping into your power, expanding your inner light, self-love and raising your vibration. It's always about focusing on being a better and stronger you. When your vibration shifts, you shift the vibration of Earth with you. This brings more light, love and positive changes into our world. Work towards shining your brightest light. You are a light warrior, not a victim. Your intuition is a gift and is meant to alert you to information that your other senses sometimes miss. If you feel that something is not right about a person, a place or a situation, trust your guidance. Often, I see you second-guess yourself in an effort to be good, nice or right. In truth, your intuition is neutral and makes no judgments. It is that part of you that guides you away from energy not meant for you. I am with you today, helping you develop and trust your intuition. Your intuition makes you powerful have confidence in it. A person who cares about you protects your mental health. They are not doing things like gaslighting, giving you the silent treatment, and confusing you. They don't manipulate and try to control you by using coercive abuse tactics. They are not passive aggressively saying things to hurt your feelings, get back at you or punish you. Basically they are not mind fking you by any means possible as a way to get what they want from you. It is illegal to physically hurt someone. It should be illegal to mentally, psychologically, and emotionally damage a person as well. This is just as dangerous, if not more so, because these wounds are more difficult to heal and can take much longer to recover from. Type 333 If you trust God, tune into your body. Are you doing, doing, doing and pushing, pushing, pushing and going, going, going? It's time to take a breather. If you have been overworking, overdoing or overthinking, your intuition weakens, you feel overwhelmed and confused, your vibration drops, and your aura becomes dull, it's okay to take a break. Stop, rest, recharge. Watch that movie, read that book. You will notice the clarity coming back to you when you are recharged. Your vibration and intuition heightens, manifestations are instant, and your aura glows. What you're about to discover today is life-changing. One minute you're struggling to pay bills, swamped with money worries, and the next minute. You're attracting money like steel to a magnet. What makes this life-changing difference in people's lives? It's called the genetic wealth code once you activate it. Your life will never be the same again. You can activate your genetic wealth code here today. It's best to activate this code now.
while this page is still live. Tap the link in my comments to activate your genetic wealth code. Type. I am ready to shine. To affirm. Don't feel guilty for taking a break. The world will still go on. You are not who you once were and things are not as it was before. Come into acceptance that things have changed. You have changed. Embrace this change. Layer by layer, peel off your safety shields masks that you put on due to your past conditioning and trauma. Come into the light as the true and authentic you. Let go of old coping safety mechanisms, attachments, and the need for external validations. You are powerful. You are enough. You are perfect and you are beautiful inside and out. Embrace the new you and move forward, child of light. It is time for you to be free again. Type 444. If you believe, your body is asking for deep rest and relaxation as it's going through transformation at a cellular level and you are going through deeper healing within yourself. Nourish yourself with good food, extra sleep, cleanliness, nature, sunlight and letting go more. Flow with life by embracing each moment. Look for triggers in the present moment that date back to something traumatic that you experienced in the past, as it's ready to be healed now. All you have to do to allow that healing is to allow yourself to feel into those emotions and tell your inner child self, you are safe, you are loved, you deserve joy. And let that deep sense of integration take over your body. You don't have to do anything that doesn't feel peaceful. You aren't obligated to your own self-created rules. Go with what feels peaceful. Your intuition is guiding you. Hold an optimistic and curious approach for the unknown. Know that your best days are yet to come. Don't lose hope and enjoy every opportunity to love yourself and keep creating the best reality. Peace. Type Amen if you agree. You've had a change of heart that has altered the direction of your life in a positive way. The changes you are experiencing are divinely directed by your newborn willingness to open your heart to love and divine guidance. Your old ways of living no longer interest you and you find yourself avoiding friends and pastimes that previously attracted you. You desire a lifestyle and career that will better fit your new interests and passions. The angels are guiding you through this time of transition. The law of attraction ensures that you'll manifest wonderful new opportunities and relationships. Comment, Amen. If you believe, gifts. This one minute prayer from biblical time manifests wealth and abundance into your life. If you're a spiritual person and empath looking to better the world and yourself, then this will be the most important message you read all day. Because once you hear this divine prayer, you will finally break the curse of poverty and restore your connection with the universe, allowing you to ask, manifest and receive an abundance of blessings. Tap the link in my bio and listen to the one minute prayer now. Many of us should rethink our strategy. Perhaps you've been chasing money or some other object of desire. The angels of abundance remind you that whatever you run after usually runs the other way. The underlying fears that compel chasing behavior are the very same ones that result in lack and disappointment. 
instead of chasing, attracting can bring your desires to fruition. Attraction happens when you speak positively and hold positive thoughts and visions about your manifestations. Anytime your soul feels overwhelmed with anxiety, that's the universe telling you your next breakthrough is around the corner. When a chapter is ending, things get confusing, hard, and infuriating. That's why you have to remain high-spirited, grateful, and focused throughout your journey. Don't give negative energy a chance to linger around, not even for a second. There are two roads you can take at this point. One that repeats the same cycles you're currently experiencing or one that throws you into a world of new beginnings. Whatever you decide, let your intuition guide you and your faith inspire you. You're getting closer to greatness each day. Type. I love you God. To affirm. 666 you're about to receive the most unexpected blessing of your life. You're about to meet the reason why your soul had to garner all that patience, humility, and faith. You're about to experience the rare, unparalleled magic of a miracle. Just watch. One day very soon, nothing will be as it once was. Your path is about to shift for the greater good of your journey. Brace your spirit as it prepares to plunge into the depths of a highly metamorphic chapter. Your recent growth is about to pay off in the most profound and gratifying way. Stay tuned. You have a soft heart and a pure soul. That's why you feel everything so deeply. Be clear on one thing. This is your superpower, not your weakness. The world needs more of you so don't suppress who you are. It is not your job to heal every person you meet, but it's your job to make sure your kind nature remains intact throughout your journey. Stay close to those who genuinely appreciate you, and stay far away from those whose only goal is to take advantage of your energy. You are one of the rare gems the universe has blessed with heightened clairvoyance and divinity. Keep shining your light everywhere you go. Type. I love you God. To affirm. It's easy to look back and question decisions you have made in the past. But it's unfair to punish yourself for them. You can't blame yourself for not knowing back then what you know now. And the truth is you made each decision for a reason based on how you were feeling at the time. As we grow up, we learn and we evolve. Maybe the person you are now would have done things differently back then. Or maybe you are the person you are now because of the decisions you made back then. Trust your journey. It's all going to make sense soon. Decide what you want. Believe you can have it. Believe you deserve it and believe it's possible for you. And then close your eyes and every day for several minutes and visualize having what you already want, feeling the feelings of already having it. Come out of that and focus on what you're grateful for already and really enjoy it. Then go into your day and release it to the universe and trust that the universe will figure out how to manifest it. May the Lord's face shine upon you. 96% of people have no clue this method exists. For manifesting money, there is a powerful manifestation technique. It changes your beliefs on reality in the deepest level of the subconscious mind. It literally changed my life. Give it an honest try. 
Click the link in our bio to see if this works for you too. You're about to receive the most unexpected blessing of your life. You're about to meet the reason why your soul had to garner all that patience, humility, and faith. You're about to experience the rare, unparalleled magic of a miracle. Just watch. One day very soon, nothing will be as it once was. Your path is about to shift for the greater good of your journey. Your recent growth is about to pay off in the most profound and gratifying way. Stay tuned. Yes, it is time for a move. Angels and your spirit. Guides are working to keep your spirit and energy high during this move. All that is requested is your trust. Trust that the Divine and the Angels are capable of finding just the right place for you. If you decide on one certain place and it doesn't work out, it is because they are bringing you something that's even better. Expect miracles to occur that allow you to afford this change. Stay positive and don't buy into illusions or scarcity thinking. The angels will smoothen the way and will also help you meet new people who can illuminate your path. Type. I believe in myself. To affirm. The key to manifesting anything is to honor and even celebrate where you are now while keeping your eyes on the prize. Yes, of course you're eager to move further ahead on your path, that's good. It's a sign you're going in the right direction. Just don't sacrifice your joy now because you aren't at the finish line yet. Appreciation attracts more things to appreciate. Be proud of yourself for your progress so far. You're doing amazing things and you're right on schedule. The moment your soul decides what it wants, a new pathway will open up for you. Signs will start to appear, making sure you move in the direction you're meant to go in. Don't take your journey for granted. You're not a simple being, you're a divine one. Seek those whose energy feels genuine and pure. Release yourself from the hold of those trying to pull you back. Keep aligning with your vision until it manifests before your eyes because soon enough it will. We live in a world where you can binge watch an entire TV series in one day and have meals delivered to your door in a jiffy. The point, we are not good at waiting for things nor savoring the journey. Spirits reminds you that the universe is playing a long game. Just because things haven't appeared instantly does not mean they aren't ever going to happen. Keep investing in your goals, keep doing the work, and keep the faith. I know it's not easy but your dreams are too important to give up on. Everything you are learning along the W will add up to something. Live in a world where you can binge watch an entire TV series in one day and have meals delivered to your door in a jiffy. The point, we are not good at waiting for things nor savoring the journey. Spirits reminds you that the universe is playing a long game. Just because things haven't appeared instantly does not mean they aren't ever going to happen. Keep investing in your goals, keep doing the work, and keep the faith. I know it's not easy but your dreams are too important to give up on. Everything you are learning along the W will add up to something. Type. This too shall pass. To affirm. If you want to attract huge money effortlessly, starting today, Check link in comments below to know the shocking wealth secrets, 
revealed by rogue NASA scientists. Subscribe our channel if you believe in God. Yes, it is time for a move. Angels and your spirit. Guides are working to keep your spirit and energy high during this move. All that is requested is your trust. Trust that the divine and the angels are capable of finding just the right place for you. If you decide on one certain place and it doesn't work out, it is because they are bringing you something that's even better. Expect miracles to occur that allow you to afford this change. Stay positive and don't buy into illusions or scarcity thinking. The angels will smoothen the way and will also help you meet new people who can illuminate your path. God has seen the path that you are on and the company that you keep. He knows that there is someone in your life who is causing you harm, whether it be physically, emotionally, or spiritually. This person may have a hold on you, leading you down a destructive path that is not in line with God's plan for you. And while you may not see it now, this person is not meant to be a part of your life. God is speaking to you now because he sees the potential for great harm in the future if this person remains in your life. He wants to save you from pain and suffering and guide you towards a better and brighter future. But in order for this to happen, you must listen to his warning and take action. Type. I believe in myself. To affirm. Now, I know that it can be tempting to ignore such a message. After all, it may seem easier to just continue on the path you are on, ignoring the signs and warnings along the way. But God is not one to be ignored, and he has made it clear that if you choose to ignore this warning, there will be consequences. God has said that if you skip over this message and continue to allow this person to be a part of your life, he will punish you. This may seem harsh, but it is a necessary step to protect you from harm. God loves you and wants what is best for you, and sometimes that means taking drastic measures to get our attention. Type yes to affirm this to yourself. So I implore you, dear reader, to take this warning seriously. Listen to the divine being who is trying to communicate with you and take action to remove this harmful person from your life. Trust in God's plan for you and know that he will guide you towards a better and brighter future if you choose to follow his warning. Remember, you have been warned. The choice is now yours to make. Will you continue down a destructive path, or will you listen to God's warning and make a change for the better? The decision is yours, but I urge you to choose wisely. Take care of yourself. Type yes if you're ready. And share this video with five people who trust God. Comment. Jesus is Lord. To support our channel, please subscribe our channel and turn on bell notification.